We like to say that our work is a mix of play and provocation and we like to gently disrupt social codes and norms in different ways. For the last few years we've been really interested in doing that in public spaces. So how can we make bodies exist and move through space differently, particularly to become more powerful because public space, even though it's shared, sometimes there are really tight rules around what we're allowed to do and what we're not allowed to do in them, particularly if we have different identities and bodies. So here in Bassano we've been really thrilled to work with the Dance Well group because they of course are more mature bodies. They have so much experience to bring with them and so much experience of play. Our work is really a lot about play um, and, and about kind of uh, challenging ways of being um, in space and um, with our bodies and preconceptions of what people think we should or shouldn't do um, and a kind of sense of like mischief of misbehaving and it's so joyful to do that with with a group of, of older adults because they have a lot of mischief that they <laughs> um, maybe are not allowed to show in everyday life and that sense of mischief and play and fun uh, very quickly came out with the task that we worked with. Ho imparato nuove gestualità, nuovi modi di danzare ed anche nuovo modo di stare con gli altri, di condividere il lavoro fatto assieme. Insomma, cercavano dieci danzatori un po' spregiudicati, diciamo. Mi sono trovato senz'altro bene, eh, devo solo ringraziarle. Anche il lavoro fatto qua dentro è stato bellissimo, secondo me. La classe condivisa con Leeds, con gli Yorkshire, no? Yorkshire sì. è stato molto giocoso anche lì perché erano delle persone anche loro come noi, della nostra età così, che si divertivano tantissimo anche loro come ci stiamo divertendo noi e è stato bellissimo vederci, fare delle cose insieme, loro facevano cose che facevamo noi e viceversa, uno scambio. Anche se siamo in Italia e in Inghilterra facciamo le stesse cose, <ride> vogliamo fare le stesse cose. We are really interested, particularly here, to explore play in the park, the beautiful park, and in the play equipment. <laughs> um, obviously, it's a space that, even though it's public, is usually designated for children, but it feels like, as adults, it's really crucial for us to play at all times. <laughs> it's what life is about. It's joyful. So, with that mix, play, provocation, power, We've been inviting the, uh, the people here, the Dancewell group, uh, to explore the park in a sensory way, in a curious way, as if they were going back to their childhood. Um, and they've been climbing and scaling things <laughs> and uh, waving at teenage boys as they come past and saying hello and dancing for them. Uh, so it's a way of taking up space and saying, I'm here, I'm going to enjoy myself. <laughs> Innanzitutto per me la parola libertà è la cosa che mi fa muovere, è la motivazione più grande. Libertà, condivisione e l'amicizia e l'affetto che abbiamo tra di noi e con tutti i coreografi nuovi che ci vengono a far fare delle cose stupende. Questo laboratorio era proprio incentrato sulla relazione tra di noi, nel fidarsi, ci hanno proposto delle attività e dei giochi proprio, per esempio lasciarsi guidare con gli occhi chiusi, oppure trovare un, un modo di muoversi, di muoversi tutti insieme. Quindi è stata anche una cosa giocosa, spiritosa, diciamo. Sì, forse posso lasciarmi più andare nel, nel danzare, insomma. Gosh, uh, so much! I feel like I have gained so much. A new sense of play and joy and pleasure in, in dancing and moving. And I think I have also 
uh, yeah, gained a sense of being able to do more with less words. It's amazing to see how it could work uh, across cultures and across languages because there is so much that you can say with your body. And just, yeah, I hope I have their energy and fun, sense of fun when I am that age. <laughs>